Hey Tano, what's up? Hope you're enjoying the season of giving. So update 22.8 just arrived, along with many things. With that, I want to go over the new event, which is the Ghoul Purge event. So let's get right to it. Upon logging in, you'll be prompted from a transmission from the Lotus saying there have been ghouls breaking out near and around Cetus, which will prompt you to head to Cetus to help Kanzu out. You'll be automatically transported to Cetus. Once at Kanzu, choose bounties. And you'll have a choice of two tier bounties with the Ghoul event. The first tier being level 15 and 25 and yielding the Stubo weapon? Stubbo weapon? And the second being level 40 to 50 and yielding the Quartac Grenier rifle. And also unique to both mission rewards, also carrying the Encrypted Journal Fragment, which adds a new codex entry to the lore behind this event. So since doing both tiers, there aren't anything that really change in the mission bounties, they're just dynamically switched up. Only difference is they offer a different amount of Austrian standing and weapon blueprints. So with that being said, here's what you can basically expect to happen in these bounties. Bounty 1, Sabotage. Grab the supply beacon, then destroy the supply drops as they come in. Bounty 2. Bounty 2 will require you to take out the barrel ground of where the new Grenier Ghoul enemy will emerge, along with the other new Ghoul units to appear. Go to each of the burial grounds and clear them out, with a total of 3 burial grounds to be cleared. Bounty 3. Bounty 3 is a simple rescue and escort bounty, which is to rescue and escort the ghoul defector. Bounty 4. Finding the processor cell. Lotus will instruct you to find the grok jewel resource with a total of 10. And after you have collected 10, get to the drop point. The injector will drop and defend it for the remainder of its injector status. Done. So yeah, that's the ghoul purge event for update 22.8. If you really found the video helpful or enjoyable in some way, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And just to iterate, I am working on some new alternative Arsenal episodes, but with the delayed impending uh, update to IPS damage, uh, it's going to be a while till we see that, so I'm kind of waiting for that to drop so I can revise my, I guess you could say, information for those episodes, but uh, yeah, the holidays are in swing, and I hope you tenor are having a merry, merry Xmas.